Hey GTI fans, welcome back to another series of Imperial Galactic Survival. Yep, you see it, it's Alpha 12.0. This is dropped to the stable branch today, so I think we need to go give it a try. So let's do that. Um, first of all, let's run through some settings really quick here. I think uh, some criteria are, I want to do the tutorial because they've revamped the tutorial and it's supposed to be better. Um, I've, I've already play tested and experimental it is. It, it runs through more of a story arc now um, so that'll lead into more understanding on kind of where they're going with the overall story arc. Um, so I want the tutorial. Um, I don't really like temperate planets because you can't really fly around very well in with the hover vehicle like it's just uh unless it's on water um but you know so other than that the snow planet start uh, which is a new start and the swamp planet start so the swamp planet is basically temperate and ugh, the visibility sucks i don't have to prove myself on starting on a difficult planet uh, I've done it through Iron Man competitions and whatnot. That's that's not what I'm here today. I want to experience the new content. So I want the tutorial. Um, I want to be able to whip around and get resources pretty quick and stuff and go through the game quickly. So I don't want to start on temperate. I don't want to start on the swamp because it's basically temperate. Uh, the snow has no tutorial. Or at least I believe it had none. They, the swamp does. The snow has no... No tutorial there. No tutorial given. Okay. So that's what I thought. Uh, so really the only option... I'm going to go for the arid start. The arid planet start. Uh, the seed looks fine. Um, so we're going to start on 767138. If anyone wants to follow along, that's fine. Difficulty settings. Um, I'm going to make it fairly difficult on myself. It's a non... I believe it was... Hang on. Let's go back. Yeah, no no oxygen on this planet. So let's let's ramp it up then, right? So make it make it hard on myself. So it's basically all the hardest settings. I just, I just selected hard up here. And then changed a couple of things. I changed the crafter speed to fast, the blueprint repair speed to fast, and all the true false settings I set to true, and the amount of ore to rich and the number of deposits to plenty. Other than that, those are all the hard settings for the player equipment, uh, all that crap. And the life stats, that's all on the hard settings. So it's going to be difficult. It's just going to be fast crafting, basically. Okay. So let's just jump in. Let's do it. So medium size, yeah, that's good. I don't, I don't want to go with a large planet. It just takes forever to explore. Let's do it. Okay, so also it's a much faster start. The, the the game loads up a lot faster because they don't um, have to build every single planet at once. So you can see, boom, we're already in. Uh, I see some wreckage. There's a large one down there. Um, but then right below us, there's a bunch too, eh? So, okay, well, let's just aim. Let's aim for this wreckage here. Not sure what would happen if I crashed onto it. Uh, oh, there's critters right there. You know what? Let's just plunk it down beside it. I don't want to screw around without getting with out being able to get my gear. So these critters are okay. They don't. They're um, they're fine. Oh, here we go. Emergency situation detected. Protocol blah has been initiated. I'm not going to read out this whole thing. If you guys want to read this stuff, um, you're going to have to pause and read it because I'm just going to go ahead and activate. Um, okay. Ship status destroyed due to malfunction in the engine system. Current situation. 
crash on unknown planet. Okay. So it looks like it's assessing our situation. We abandoned, successfully abandoned. Okay, good. And we are low but stable. Yeah, you can see down in the left-hand corner, the, the health bar is at 150 out of 500, and our food situation is 139 out of 500. Uh, so it wants us to start the ropes and protocol, and we're going to get hit OK on there. Okay, so access pod, we want to hit F. So go up to our pod, we hit F, and we grab everything. So let's just grab everything. Use drag and drop or shift left mouse. So we can just do that and dump it all onto us. Okay. Uh, we got to familiarize ourselves with the heads up now. Use the mouse and hover over the various icons and information areas. This will reveal helpful descriptions and specifications. Yes, that's true. But I'm going to skip past that. <laughs> okay, so heads up display. We, it's it's going to force us to anyway. So hit F1. Oops, I bumped it again. Anyway, it it, it basically wanted us to... Hit F1, look at our stuff, and then get out of there again. Now we've got to hit the tab to get into our inventory. And um, so it also wants us to take a energy bar. should eat an energy bar right now. Okay, well, let's do that. We've got two of them. Uh, use a health pack too, eh? Okay. Well, we've only got one. We did start on hard, right? So our loadout is completely different than, a, than if you start on medium or, or easy. Uh, you get more gear when you start on an easier setting. Uh, I don't even have a constructor made, uh, so I don't have anything to power my O2 condenser. So this could be interesting. Equip survival tool. Okay. Equip the survival tool. And then it wants us to pick up ore. Okay, well, I really need to get a constructor going, but we will get ore. Uh, I'm going to go into third-person view. It's just a little easier to see. And, you know, I'm going to turn my jetpack on, hit J, and look at all this stuff for us to pick. So we, we've got to find ore. So I'm just going to pick this stuff. I don't want to consume... Um, a lot of energy, so I'm going to use my jetpack to move around more quickly instead of my uh, instead of hitting shift and consuming my stamina. I don't want to really do that. So here's some ore here. Let's do that. Select our survival tool. I'm going to right click on it to select the resource drill, and we're just going to drill away. Okay. Okay, so we didn't pick up enough. Uh, I see some more over there. Let's go over there. I, I'm grabbing all this stuff. I know it doesn't tell me to, but it doesn't matter. You don't have to play through the tutorial in specific order. Uh, and it does give you a way... Oh, level two. There we go. Okay, there we go. Uh, so it wants us to put down our oxygen storage, place it, and fuel it. Well, I. This is unfortunately we can't do. We can't because we got to make the. So they got to fix this. I think on hard, this does not work on hard start. Okay, I guess you wouldn't do the tutorial on hard, right? Okay, that, I get that. I I understand you probably wouldn't do the tutorial on hard. I just want to check to see if there's stuff down here. Oh, it looks like a box right here. Yeah. We'll grab all that. Nice. Effective wound, dermal burn, frostbite. Frostbite's not going to help too much right now, but effective against stunned. Okay. Uh, so what we'll do is it wants us to place it down. That's all fine and dandy. We don't have a constructor, and it gets us to make a constructor pretty much soon after this. So it's like it's a little bit of out of order. Uh, so I'm going to show you what I'm going to do to skip past this. So we're going to place it down. 
And then, oh, you know what? It didn't need it, but it wanted emergency O2 bottles used. Okay, you know what? We do have O2 bottles, so maybe, maybe I can do this without cheating. So we'll go into a survival constructor and make some O2 bottles. We can make like six. Okay. You know what? I'm going to use one right now. There we go. Your oxygen level in the bottom of the blah, blah, blah. Yeah, check the water O2 condenser frequently. I can't power it up right now anyway, so we're just going to grab it. What's this to harvest? What's this to harvest? Okay, so it wants us to harvest these protein plants here. I'm just going to change to my multi-tool. And then it wants us to craft an energy bar, so we'll do that. Those are done. Here, let's, we'll just take those right now. I, most, I know most of you guys on, on easier settings would, would have this running right now with whatever fuel they gave you. But I don't have that luxury. You know, it's on, uh, that's only 35. Yeah, we'll just take that too. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to craft energy bar. We'll just get a stack going. Hopefully we'll grab some more here. Yep. So if you notice, the you walk a little bit slower than when you use the jetpack. When you use the jetpack, you can really propel yourself forward quickly. Oh, and it did something there. Uh, I guess it made my, it made my, um, my bar, right? Yeah, my energy bar. Okay, so open map, M, offers details. Like I say, if you guys want to read this stuff, pause. Okay, um, so it wants us to go up to this large wreckage. Fine. I just want to grab a bunch of food first. And just craft up a ton of bars here. We can do this really quickly because they're just everywhere around here. This is actually a pretty decent seed. Grab this copper here too. And uh, want to keep our eyes open for some silicon. I might have to go down to the water for it. I'm not sure if we're going to find any in the crash area. I mean, we found iron and copper in the crash area. I'm not sure if we get silicone or not. We might. We might. What I'm really looking for, though, is all these plants here that can be turned into bars. The alien thorn are good later on. Okay, you notice that the temperature there got a little bit hotter than what we could actually sustain for a bit. My, um, I had a little warning that the degrees temperature thing went to red like it is right now. See that? It just went up to 47 degrees over on the right-hand side. My body temperature is still 25, so it hasn't went up. So that's good. Uh, we can probably hang out in, you know, the, the mid mid 40s low 50s without it raising too too fast it will raise and if it starts getting a little bit too high we can always throw down our our um, portable heater cooler which let's swap that out there so we want to go to the source i know we still want to go there <laughs> we're going the opposite way but i ooh look at that cool not sure if you take damage if you get hit by those. I don't think I've ever been hit by them. I think I've tried. I mean, yes, I have tried. I know I've tried. Okay, so we can start heading over there now. I've got like a crap ton of these... Uh, of these protein plant protein bars picked so we'll just try and I'm trying to head over there I just keep seeing them they're worth experience too so it's worth picking them 
even if I don't eat them all. Okay, so now make a little straighter beeline for it. I do need to get some rocks. So here's a rock right here. Let's let's mine this. We'll pick that up. And I do need some wood too. So what we can do is we switch to defense mode with our salvage tool. And that'll cut down the tree for us. At least I think it'll cut down the tree for us. There we go. There we go. Three, three wood logs. Okay. Let's do this one too. Okay, um, let's put our detector down there and in our bar. So this is new Alpha 12. They've added a ping function with our detector. It now is actually a, um, a you can actually use it and it, see, reveals stuff way off in the distance too, which is nice. It'll, it'll reveal drones that are way off in the distance up to like about a kilometer or so uh what we should do is we should actually eat some of these right now we'll eat that one i'm not sure if stuff spoils in your i think it doesn't i don't think it spoils while it's still in your output so if you leave a stack of food in your output which we don't really have a luxury we need to eat what's in there right now but I like to keep a stack of energy bars in here. It's just like an emergency. And speaking of, let's get more of those going. Then. So we've got tons. Let's just queue up like 30. And we'll grab some more of this oxygen. Now the oxygen is going to start getting to be a problem here. So we really need to start moving then. So let's go. Let's deal with this. We should be able to make a... Um, we should be able to make a constructor once we get to the large wreckage and make some biofuel. I don't want to leave myself too, too short of time and suffocate. That can always be a, a bad start to, you know, <laughs> suffocate suffocate for your start not that i haven't done that i absolutely have but they've made it a lot easier now you don't have to hit third level uh because you used to have to be third level to make the constructor oh we got another rock here we'll dig that up see another one over here too like we're going to be down near water, which isn't too bad. Well, close enough to water. We're going to need some more copper, though. See, iron. That's fine. You only need iron now to build the constructor, the portable one, so... That uh, makes that even easier now, too. You used to have to have, like, uh, uh, some ore of each type and be third level. So sometimes sometimes you could hit third level and still not find a little chunk of silicone or something. You know, it would be, like, infuriating. Oh, speaking of silicone, there's some right there. Okay, let's start heading over to it. I think we've got plenty of... Uh... Oh, do, what about... Eight, eight logs? Yeah, that's fine for now. We can always grab some more later. Temperature's really climbing. We're going to have to put down our uh, heater. Oh, wow. We're gonna, let's, let's do that right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on. There you go. There you go. Bring that back down. Wow, it's already... Uh, 
it can only bring it down to 30 degrees because it's so hot out. That could be bad. Okay. So let's head over to the silicone here. And it's a little cooler over here. Near closer to the crash site, I guess. And we'll gotta go closer and loot the wreckage. Nice. Okay. Oh, it's actually pretty close to uh, a fertile little area here with some uh, with some snacks right there. That's not too bad. It's not too bad at all. Ah. Okay. Let's grab that up really quick here. I know our oxygen, our oxygen. I gotta get moving here. Okay. Let's get up there. No more dilly dallying. We should have what we need to make the constructor. Okay, we gotta loot everything. Here we go. Let's loot everything. Yay! Portable constructor. Now we gotta unlock the tech tree. So F3. And then I think it's miss. There it is. Portable constructor costs one. Okay. Um, and it's level one. So, okay. And then we want to craft it. So we want to go into here and let's stop that crap. And we make that. Okay. Uh, oh, we got a biofuel out of there. So why don't we... Okay, well that's that's cool. Let's get this. Uh, uh, let's salvage this. Okay. Here, let's get uh, and we're cooking too. So let's let's do this. Let's put this. And we'll get this down. Uh, we'll get this going with that. There we go. Got a couple here we can consume. Okay, well, I didn't know we we're going to start with a biofuel in the container. So we've constructed it, now it wants us to place it, so let's put that in our backpack, just put it on us, and we'll just throw it down there, there we go, portable heater cooler, here we'll just pick it up and put it back down, and it'll save our lives, survival tent, I don't think this area is big enough. Um, Okay, so we've got a survival tent. Um, oh, there we go. That's pretty good right there. And then craft a motor pike and deploy it. Uh, oh, I thought it... Yeah, it gave us a motorbike kit. So let's throw that in there and construct that. Nice. Grab that. And you know what? I'm going to throw all this stuff in here now. Don't need that. Don't need that. Don't need that. Don't need that. I'm going to actually see what I can construct in the constructor with this, this stuff. Hold on to that. Oh, we've got a gun here. So let's equip that with some bullets. Nice. Put that in there. Uh, make some ointment. Seven herbal leaves are going to perish eventually. We can make plant fiber. Let's do that. We'll make some plant fiber because we've got the O2 going right now. So it's it's not like making making the biofuel isn't like super duper critical right now. I wouldn't mind some more bandages. 
and we'll, we'll make a couple of that. Okay, so that's it. That that can make for. That's crappy. Okay, so we did. I not put. Oh, we got everything in there. Okay, uh, we can make grilled steak. That's pretty cool. Vegetable juice. So we can make vegetable juice, which will health 43, stamina 35. Well, be, oh, you know what? Let's make some of that because we can't make that in our in our um, survival constructor. So we can make it in the portable constructor here. Nice. Nice. And that'll heal us up. Okay. And what else we need to eat? So we can make some some steaks. Food. Oh, they heal you too, eh? Okay. A little bit. Not much. Need like three of those. Yeah. Okay, sweet. So now what do we got to do? We have to deploy the motorbike. Did I grab it? I did. Yes. So let's grab that. Throw that there. And deploy it. Starting to get late too. And now it wants us to craft a weapon and ammo. Okay, so I'm just going to pick that up again. Uh, well, we've got a pistol, so we don't need a pistol. What I want is a shotgun. So let's let's unlock that. So we'll go to weapons. Shoddy, we unlock that. And we'll just hold off on the rest right now. I'll just unlock stuff as I need it. Okay, uh, how's our O2? We've got nothing on us, so got some there. And the water we can turn into a smaller one. And we don't have a lot of time on there, so we will need to make some biofuel pretty quick. Uh, but it does want us to make the shotgun, so let's do let's do that. And here, let's. Do one of those. We'll do some food here. Add in there. And one more. We're almost healed up. That's nice. So the weapon. Let's make the shoddy. And yeah, we've got enough for some shotgun shells. I don't want to. I don't want to dig in the crushed stone to do that. It seems kind of a waste. Okay. How's our time? One and a half hours till sunset. That's good. We're doing good here. And then, and then, I'm gonna want to craft like ten biofuel. Yeah. Okay. So um, we're third level. Oh, there. Just finished. Oops, here, let's go like this. Go back in there. Let's go. And you can see it gave us 10 more points doing the tutorial, which is nice. You get a whole bunch of free unlock points right early on, so you can really plow through a lot of your unlocks. Um, I mean, 27 points to play with. We, we do need a multi-tool. It's only three. Let's do that. And then we are going to need a bunch of the hover engine hover stuff but we can hold off so but oh right now it wants us to find the hover bike it's right over there it's right there okay we got a minute let's go check it out i can afford to sprint a little bit now we've got lots of food so when you uh, consume your stamina it uses your food to re-energize it slowly so it consumes your food really fast. Okay, we've got to sit in the passenger or in the driver's seat, so we'll just hit F, and then it wants us to um, do the control panel, so we're going to hit P for the control panel, and it wants us to take a look to see what's missing, the generator and fuel tank. Okay. Okay, we'll jump out of there. We'll head back over here. 
So we know we got to make a generator and fuel. Oh, look at that, a resource. Did you see that? Here, let's let's ping. And it found it, iron and a silicone right there. Oh, so we're really close to some resources. And another uh, 1.2, but the iron and silicone right there, very nice. Oh, and another one fairly close there too. So, oh, and wait. Did I, did, I thought I saw iron. Iron? Oh, yeah. And copper. Oh, all oh, right here. <laughs> Holy crap. The trifecta of, of awesomeness. If we uh, found promethium at the same time, it would be unbelievable. But, you know. Okay, so they're all right around us. Well, that's uh, really good. That will that gets us exactly the starting materials that we're going to need. Um, but I think what we're going to do is finish off this episode by oh it just built it some biofuel for us there we go by grabbing the shotgun equipping that put that down number one slot um got some shells and then we're gonna put the biofuel here let's um Grab some more O2. You can see we go through O2 pretty quick, and that's because this, all the settings are set to hard. Okay, but what we can do is we're going to set all these in here, I think. Yeah, we're going to put all of them in there. Okay, so we can make the purified water. Excellent. Got a bunch of those. Okay, so what else? Um, you know what? Here, let's grab that and grab that. We'll get our suit making more uh, bars. Grab those and we'll just... Whatever you can do, just do it. Okay. And I think what we want to do is we want to make sure, so that's going to craft four more. I think we need more though. So let's do, it's going to fry everything we have. You know what? Let's just do it. Let's just do it. We can always get some more wood. I want a bunch of biofuel to start tomorrow. And there we go. It is night. Uh, let's use our tent and we'll call it an episode. So we'll use our tent. There's no critters around, so it allows us to sleep for the night. And by magic, we didn't consume any oxygen while sleeping for some reason, which is awesome. <laughs> and we can look in here, and voila! We have mass amounts of oxygen at our disposal, and it didn't run out, so that's good. We'll just top us up here. And all of our plant protein is gone. That would say that, yeah, it made a ton of bars. So now I've got lots of food on me, lots of oxygen. Uh, we are ready to go digging, I guess. But it wants us to add, craft a generator and craft a fuel tank for the, um, for the hover. I was going to say the hover tank. It's not really a tank, but for the... Uh, for the hover vehicle, um, but I think that'll be next up. So we got 16 biofuels, so we're rocking there, and then we don't have the resources. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go, I'm going to go mine um, resources off camera, and then bring them back here so that we have what we need to continue on with this with the uh, um, Robson protocol. So until then. You guys have yourselves an awesome...